This is me at the local Valero. Uh, just started learning the tune. My uh, LT, my 95Z28 LT1. It's got OBD1. And as you can see, I got my laptop up here. I got my IAC count and my GPS voltage. And let's just get a little picture of the car. Another. 17 by 11 ZR1 rims in the back with 315, 35, 17 needle drag radios. And up front, I got 17 by 9.5 ZR1 uh, rims with uh, needle 275, 45, ZR17. Here's the original LT1, 30 over with a scat lower end. Can't really see much, but it's got LT4 heads uh, ported. It's got the LT4 intake port mat. You, know, you can notice my little LT4 badge on the 58 millimeter BBK throttle body. Home built cold air system. We just put that on about a week ago. Really woke the car for the aftermarket elbow. And the car's pretty clean. Clear coat's coming off, but that's normal. Just let me get back around there and I'll start this piece of shit for you. Actually, this piece of shit loves tearing up ricers and mustangs. <laughs> Texas brood here, baby. There's the laptop. With, of course, Data Master. As you can see, I got my AC counts. Well, we gotta see them in a minute. But let's hear all this bad boy sounds. I still got to do some air fuel ratio changes. If you notice my split, one side's rich, one side's lean. Up here, that's my uh, long term, short term counts. AC worse than this, I got a uh, pace setter long tube header with a uh, custom uh, belt 3 inch X pipe with bullet mufflers and just recently added 2.5 inch detail pipe. Car sounds pretty good for an LT4 hot cam. Still working on it, still got a stock clutch in it. Stock clutch slip in, it's on 1269, 1271, and 113. With the original clutch slipping, actually went 1330s slipping. Dipped it normally and letting off the throttle a little bit is where I got the 212 second run. Doing 2.18 and uh, 2.22 60 foot time. Spinning pretty bad, launching at 3 grand. And that's about it. I'm just getting her going little by little. Hope you enjoyed it. Thank you.